In this video, I'm going to teach you how to change FOV in Cry of Fear. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In order to change the FOV in Cry of Fear, you will have to use console commands. Even if you browse through all of the categories here, keyboard, mouse, audio, video, voice, and advanced, you will not be able to find a field of view slider. So, in order to change this, all that you have to do is open your console. This will be done by pressing tilde on your keyboard, or it might be a different one if you are using a different layout. Just find out how you can open the console on Source Games. And now, once you are inside of the console, you have to use the command CL underscore FOV multiplier. So, the way that it works in this game is that by default it is going to be set to 1 and it is going to be a multiplier. So, if you increase it, it is going to multiply the FOV, meaning that you will have a wider field of view. So, I'm going to set this to 1.25, for example, and you can clearly notice the changes reflected here. So, for example, take a look on this alleyway here, how much I can see. I'm going to turn around, I'm going to open the console, and then I'm going to type out the same command, but set it to 1. So, I cannot see this graffiti on the wall anymore when I changed the value. So all that you have to do is set the FOV multiplier to whatever you want. This is how it looks with 2, it is very trippy because you can see a lot, even stuff that you're probably not supposed to see, so you might encounter rendering problems, and of course you can lower this if you prefer it. So this is how it looks at 0.85. The screen is very closed in and I can't see much around me. I believe that the comfortable spot for most people will be around 1.25, so just change the multiplier to whatever you prefer. So, if you haven't started the game already, start a new game, load in, and once you find yourself at the start of chapter 1 here, Lost in the City, you will be able to open the console and change the FOV multiplier. I hope I was able to help you on how to change FOV and cry of fear. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.